Hey guys, welcome back to Fisher Double Fact. Today, I'm so excited to share with you 5 interesting facts about birch, particularly jade birch and yellow birch. Fact number 1 Yellow birch and jade birch are perciformers, but they are a different family. If you thought that yellow birch and jade birch are in the same family, you are actually wrong. The fact is, both of them are perch named fish, but relatively, they came from different family. Yellow perch is classified under Persidae family, a freshwater fish native to the northern part of America, while jade perch is from Therapontidae family, a native Australian species. Both of these species appear to be different in shape and color. Yellow perch has yellowish brass colored body with 5 to 9 olive green stripe across their body and they can grow to their marketable size in within 8 to 12 months. However, jade perch is more brownish in color with dark blotches on their fin and this species could grow up to 450 grams in within 4 months and up to 800 grams in 7 months. They even grow in different water temperature. Yellow perch require much colder water which is around 18 to 23 degrees Celsius while jade perch need warmer water which is above 23 degrees Celsius for optimal growth. Fact number 2. Jade perch love veggies. So, jet perch is actually omnivore. According to one aquaponic farmer named Murray Hallam, um, he rare jet perch in his aquaponic farm and he said that his jet perch could consume leftover lettuce head that he threw into the tank. And besides lettuce, jet perch also love duckweed. As supplemental feed. So Mr. Hallam has been feeding his jade perch with leftover veggies including um, lettuce head and also duckweed as supplemental feed instead of giving only commercial pellet alone. So by doing this he could save his money from buying commercial pellet and he could reduce his veggies waste in his farm too. Fact number three the myth about high fatty acid content on jet perch. Actually, there are various sources from the internet about high fatty acid content about jet perch. But how true is this fact actually? As a matter of fact, there was a study done by um, Cyro Australia who did tests on fatty acid content on wild jet perch from Barku River, but not on farm jet perch. According to this study, yes, wild jade perch contain high content of omega-3 fatty acid compared to other species. On the other part of the world, a group of scientists from Malaysia have proven that farm jade perch will contain high omega-3 fatty acid if their diet are rich in that nutrient too. However, when comparing muscle lipid content of jade perch, with other species such as tilapia, carp, catfish, and yellow perch, jade perch is considered as oily fish due to the high lipid content in their body. Number four, yellow perch produce egg ribbons. What is egg ribbons, you ask? Here's how it looks like. Generally, when ovulation occurs, yellow perch will release her long, glutinous, sticky, ribbon-looking eggs. As the female releases her long dripping of eggs over the vegetation, the male will follow her and release his sperm along the way. Studies have shown that these ribbon eggs contain highly protective case and has been observed to be rejected by the predators 
as it contain various unpleasant chemical that inhibit them from destroying the eggs and consequently provide the offspring with impressive defense mechanism. What more interesting is, this type of eggs are exclusively found in European perch and yellow perch of freshwater fish. Fact number 5. Yellow perch female could grow faster than a male. If you watched my previous video about tilapia, you would notice that in tilapia, male are more desirable than female due to their fast growth. However, in yellow perch, another perciformer species similar as tilapia, the female are more desirable than the male because they could grow faster than the male. However, in male, um, the male could reach maturity earlier than the female in within 2-4 to four years, while the female will only reach maturity in within 3-5 to five years, although they could grow faster than the male. Well, that's 5 interesting facts about jade perch and yellow perch that you should know. If you happen to know any other facts that I didn't mention here, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up and share it and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. So with that, I would say thank you for watching and see you next time.